Hello there. Today we're going to be doing a closer look at the Funko Soda Fat Fink 5000 piece exclusive. Today we're going to be taking a closer look at the Chase and the Common. So, here is the can. One thing that happened with me, I've reached out to other people. Uh, I've reached out to a fellow YouTuber who does a lot of sodas. And they informed me what I found has never been seen by him or anyone he knows of or other people that I've talked to <clears throat> that does this. So, here's the can. Let's take a look at the milk caps, pogs, whatever you want to call them. Okay, here are the inserts that come in the bottom of the tin, can, whatever you want to call this. Here's the chase. The chase one always has a non-white color. Here's the common. Now, one thing that kind of sucks is that this one came damaged. I will never buy another one of these ever again. Obviously, I don't need to. Except for this melt cap came damaged. Sucks, but it's part of the game. Here's the back. One of 800, black and white. One of 4200, regular. Now... Right here, over the soda logo, there was this sticker. I tried to put the sticker back on the can, but it was peeling up. I tried smooshing it down. I smeared the paint. So I decided this is a better spot for it, inside the can. It's out of the way. And uh, yeah, so I got a chase out of this. You will see that in the video if you want to when I uncanned these. Um, this is what I was talking about when I reached out to people. And no one's seen this. But they do mark their mystery mains. Um, so, obviously they mark their sodas. I wonder if Freddy Funko's... Uh, <clears throat> Freddy Funko Soda has any markings on them. What they do. It's probably gonna have a chase so let's get to what we all came here for the figures I'm gonna show you the common first now he is a little wobbly so I might have to tape him down here he is I must say, I do like how his, although I'm not sure if they're, I think they're wings. There's got to be his wing. He's a bat. I've never seen the show. I am uh, looked it up. Wasn't sure who, even who he was, but I am collecting the 5,000 piece <clears throat> or vintage cartoon characters at icons. Um... But I'm mostly focusing on the uh, 5,000 piece sodas right now. So far we have a... This one. We have Speed Racer, No Chase. Yummy Mummy, we have one of each, Chase and No Chase. We have a Batman, No Chase. Um, we have a Fred Flintstone that's being pre-ordered. At Game uh, Think Geek, hoping to get it after everything ends, and I'm hoping to get a Robin and a Barney. Those are the next big ones I'm going after. Um, maybe a Frankenberry if I can get my hands on a non-open one. 
So, this is him. Pretty cool. Um, this guy is one in 4,200. This next one, 800 made. Um, this is the second most limited item I have from Funko. Um, my other one I have is the Yummy Mummy. Same amount, 800. Let's take a closer look at this guy. <clears throat> it's exactly the same figure, just black and white. Um, I honestly, when we put them side by side, I don't really like the neon orange they picked for this figure. Um, it's just bright. So, same exact one. Okay, so let's stop this 360 view and get one closer look at him. So we'll move him over. We'll put him side by side. And you can see what I mean by that orange. Just hitting you in the face. It's like, bam! It's almost like... I don't know. One of these guys is going to go back into the can. Then one of the cans is going to go with the figure back into or on the shelf. And then the other can will probably end up going in a sorter and that one will be put away. So the second time I've had luck only buying two sodas. Um, <clears throat> I'm not sure why, but I bought three Brute Fruits. I also have Brute Fruit. He's the other one I have. I have no chase for him, though. Didn't really want the chase. But I have three Fruit Brutes. I mean, two of them I would like to trade, or I'm going to put them on eBay which I'm going to be posting my uh, eBay link in my um, profile description, I guess you could say, whatever that word is I'm looking for. Um, like I said, I'm not a flipper. I don't go out and buy pops to sell. Um, there is one pop I'm going to be putting uh, up for sale, and that's going to be Captain Rex, uh, 2019, blah, 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 exclusive, hot topic, shared. Um, I've had him now for two years. He's worth like 200 plus dollars. I think it's time to cash in and buy some new pops because seriously, like, that's insane. I paid 15 bucks for it. He's got a little bit of damage done to him, so I probably get around 250, maybe 275. That's what I'm expecting. But uh, I could really buy some cool pops with that money. So here it is, Bat Fink, 500 or 5,000 limited edition piece. No exclusives anywhere. Here's the can. I wonder if they actually made Funko soda. This would be like a root beer. Which is like a root beer Dr. Pepper style. I think. So. Yeah. Have a great day. Thank you for watching. Remember to like and subscribe. I will be doing more videos like this as I get more figures. <clears throat> and I might even do one of my previous figures. Um, thank you. Have a great day.